Okay, so this is what it looks like right now, the table. Um, I actually just yesterday got a bunch of pumpkins and gourds to fill this bowl, and I have these cute napkins. I think I found these at TJ Maxx, um, but I just think they're fun. I always love a good cocktail napkin. This ginger jar and baskets, I'm gonna take all of this off. Um, but actually, I'll show you some more of our Halloween decorations. So I have this little group in I love for Pete's sake pottery. Susan does amazing um, pumpkins and like all sorts of holidays, uh, but her pumpkins are my favorite. So I have that set up here. And then here's Marty. Hi, Marty. Good boy. Um, over here I have some more stock toys ever. I just have one of her pumpkins on here as well. Miles is a Saturday morning mood. He wants to be left alone and sleeping still. Um, and then this one, she painted this um, specifically for me. I wanted it to match my Quadrel um, uh, window treatments. And I found this at Target, actually. I have a set of two of these, which I think are cute. And then I have this little pumpkin from uh, For Pete's Sake Pottery. Oh my God, say that five times fast. On um, the bar cart, I just put a little pumpkin. And then these guys are Target finds too. So a little dog skeleton and a human skeleton up there. Um, oh, and then here too, I put some little pumpkins. Um, Okay, so here is what I landed with. I took all of my gourds and pumpkins from that bowl um, and put them on here. Um, this is like some so little barley grain stuff that I have I put out. I'm so excited to use this flatware. I just got it and I think I went the other color. Um, it just looks so luxe and pretty and it makes it very fall. Um, yeah, and then it's just all about layering prints and colors. Uh, I pulled in this ginger jar, which is always on the table. I think uh, candles add some ambiance, so I added these. Um, I'll light them. It's only three of us, so that's why I have it set for three and not four. And I have our ice bucket um, for some of the bubbles that we'll have with dinner. Uh, so yeah, I brought in like oranges, greens, reds, and then some brown and tortoise um, with the flatware, the cups, and the napkin ring. And I think it looks good though. What do you guys think? Can you guys guess what we're going to be drinking tonight? Um, so I'm making apple cider Moscow mules, the apple cider's in the fridge, and then an apple cider mimosa. They are both so good on my blog. I have the recipes, um, but here's a little sneak peek. So today I am just playing catch up, doing a lot of emails, um, podcast things and calls with clients. Um, and then I am going to go get a facial at Marigold Spa. So I'll take you along for that. It is the diamond facial. I've never had one before. I've done like hydrofacials and just like traditional spa facials. Uh, so I'm excited for this one. I've heard amazing things. Um, and my skin can definitely use it after all the traveling I've been doing and I'm going to be doing. Uh, I have like, you know, this bump here that I'm not sure if it's a bug bite or a pimple coming or what um and just a lot of redness and just like tiredness so i'm excited and marty is sitting behind me i don't know if you guys can see this is how we work every day though with him right behind my chair This is what it looks like. I just got finished with it and I already feel glow. Actually in this camera, I don't even look red. It's crazy. Um, okay, so what are the benefits then? Of the, the, diamond, glow. the diamond glow. 
The Diamond Glow just helps clean the surface of your skin. It exfoliates and pulls off any um, dead skin cells and debris. And then it infuses your face with a serum that is chosen for you awesome. based on your skin. Hey guys, good morning. Um, so it is Tuesday. I woke up uh, super early to get on the road. I am meeting Rihanna. We have a little influencer trip up in New York by the lake, so it'll be really fun. Um, I am in the car. It's like a six hour drive for me, but it didn't make sense to fly because um, I would have had to like drive two hours anyway. Uh, so I'm just driving. It's a long drive, but at least it's a pretty drive kind of in the middle of nowhere and the leaves are changing. Uh, so yeah, stay tuned. I'm wearing this cozy Duffield Lane uh, little pullover that's so comfy and also like adorable. up here to the Harbor Hotel um, and it is stunning it is so pretty in the drive actually it was gorgeous with all the leaves changing um, and really serene but this hotel is great I'm gonna give you a tour I look like a mess um, but yeah I'll give you a tour of the hotel room okay so you come in and I like how they have this little ledge so you can put your keys on it um, so that you don't lose them there's a little mirror and then over to the right is the bathroom there's a toilet in the corner this is a nice big shower which is really nice it seems like everything's recently renovated um and then the mirror and sink and vanity um and apparently the products smell great i've heard here i am um and then over here we have a closet which is very spacious it's big for a hotel closet um a little desk tv um some chairs for lounging and a couch, and then a nice big bed. This room's very spacious. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's quite large. Um, and I'll take you out for the view. Okay, how amazing is this view? Look at that, it's right on the lake. And it's just so pretty. I can't wait to have a glass of wine out here later. Um, it's actually a really nice day. It's not too cold, not too hot, a little overcast. Um, and this patio is so spacious and so nice. Isn't it? It's huge. Um, but yeah, this is stunning. Okay, so we are shooting our first look right now. We are doing all the things, um, shooting, vlogging, Instagramming, everything all at once, right, Rihanna? Come no vlogging hi. over here. <laughs> <laughs> we are triple threats, stylists, <laughs> publicists, vloggers, bloggers, everything. So this is what it takes to set up the shot. Rihanna's over there getting the camera settings going. I am not savvy in that, so that's her department. Um, it's such a pretty night though. Sun's starting to set, looks gorgeous. Okay. Look number two, we are on a roll. How cute is this that Rihanna's wearing? I'm obsessed. I think I need it for my segment next week. Um, but we are wearing Duffield Lane um, and it's so pretty out. <laughs> She's <laughs> taping me now. <laughs> Yay, so we just wrapped shoots of day one. We're wearing Smith & Quinn. Say hi, Ree. Hi. How cute does she look in this with her little like this leather is pants? my favorite Smith & Quinn print yet. <laughs> I love it. And then this one, I have the blue have on this. and these cute little boots. Um, but we are so hungry, so ready to eat. We get hangry too, so we need to eat soon. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> How cute is this apple cider little bar and there's some fresh apples. It's adorable. It's a cloudy morning, but it's so quiet and relaxing here, I have to say. It's just so pretty. 
morning guys uh, so it is Wednesday um, we are still at the Chautauqua Hotel here in New York um, I just woke up so I'm, that's why I'm quiet I'm out here on uh, the deck outside of my room having some tea and doing some work and I'm wearing these adorable Heidi Carey uh, designs PJs. They have like little ski people on them. They're so cute and perfect for here. Um, they even have like this scallop detail, which I think is adorable. Um, but yeah, I am catching up on work and then Rihanna and I are shooting some content, some outfit. We normally shoot in the mornings. Um, it's the best lighting. It's not too bright and there's not too many people out. And then later we're going to some museums. So it's going to be Fun day, just have to get some work done first. Okay, day two. We just shot our first look in Toobie's Cashmere. We are tired, and, <laughs> um, but it's kind of a nice day to shoot. It's not too hot or too cold or it's rainy. Perfect. Yeah, nice, even light. And we're in the elevator, obviously. <laughs> okay, we. I just finished a call, and then we shot some more pictures, and then we have to go to the museum. But this is what vlogging and shoots and travel is really like. We have this hodgepodge of a lunch and we are still in our PJs from the shoot that we just did. And it's life on the go, you know? But it's a pretty day at least. Yep, I'm in my PJs too. Hanging out here on the porch. Okay, so I'm making my profile here, which is so cool to personalize the experience. I'm just tapping through. Um, of whose comedy I like, which is super cool. That's great. <laughs> That's fun. Oh my gosh. All right, we'll head in. Uh, okay. First, I uh, look down. It might be good for you guys. Rivers, everything from how to handle a heckler. You know, a lot of what we do is try to explain process and make sure people understand that we're not. The comedians just don't get on stage and wing it, that there's a real writing process, there's a craft to this, so go and have a heckler, she would prepare in advance for that. Look at this for Joan Rivers, her necklace, and her fashion police mug. Love her. This is so fun and interactive. You take your, um, your wristband here and then you scan it here and it puts together a show. So this one's for Rihanna and I. In the TV room, Daniel Lachman to join. The show will begin soon. This is really cool. <laughs> Am I on camera? Yeah. <laughs> um, but, and then you could, you could put like an anvil, we could put over here, and it'll tell us, and then, and again, you kind of then use it almost like a remote control to that see the so, use. I'm just so impressed with the technology. Yeah. And kids, because there's so much cartoons with props, kids, kids love hanging out here. Thank you. 